And what's alarming to me now is we've seen a number of mainstream outlets, none of whom were particularly good at holding Trump accountable for the last seven years anyway, but they're taking a pointed turn toward uh, embracing fascism. They won't, mm-hmm. they won't call it that. Uh, but that is what they're doing at CNN, at mm-hmm. uh, Politico. Um, I think it's, you know, it's racist. I think it's rooted in racism. I think there's been a lot of reevaluation of American history. Um, you know, a lot of people uh, reading books like the 1619 Project and then this incredible backlash that has occurred. And we're really living in that backlash now. And so... What worries me about this is that they seem to be taking the tack that the Republicans are going to win, that the fascists are going to win, that the white supremacists are going to win. I don't think that that would necessarily be the case in a free and fair election because they're very unpopular. You know, Trump is actually not that popular. He's probably more popular with uh, the media, I think, than he is with Americans.